and practicing from the uh, second uh, second page of the Kreisler Preludium and Allegro, um, a passage that is um, forte and then piano repeat, and then the next one again is um, first in forte and then the second in piano. And um, that's continuing yesterday's exploration with bow length. So I think um, it's, I don't really want to differentiate only with bow length because also I want some kind of compact playing. So I don't want to use too much bow for the forte passage, but maybe a little bit more bow weight also. So let's see how that comes out. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so all of them start with chords and uh, that's uh, a separate <laughs> kind of what do you say, um, construction site, so uh, I'm not worrying too much about those. There were all 40, so there was no differentiation. Yeah, I um, listen back to that tomorrow and see what I think about that. Um, the danger with these pianos, piano sections that use less bow is that they sound kind of. I don't know, lost or something. <laughs> back and then see what I want to do with this. So at least I think that's the first time really that uh, I'm making this dynamic contrast so <laughs> it's worth exploring even if this is not the best way to do it. Okay, talk to you soon and bye for now.